electric eel. That's it, pop, 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 pop. Now we're gonna set the net across. We have a nice sandy substrate so the fish can't escape underneath it, and we'll bring it all the way to both sides so the, the fish can't go around. We've moved upstream a couple of hundred meters, and we're making our way noisily towards the net. I'm hoping that somewhere in front of us is a huge eel that might help us solve our mystery. Is there more than one type of electric eel? All right, we're on our final drive. Hopefully, any eels are going to hightail it right into our trap. Nothing? Nothing. That's a killer. Oh, dear. Where in the there world did that eel go? Deep hole going way back. Now, do you hear the eel there? He's located it four feet from the net. Well, you know, while we're here, I mean, we know, if we know he's there, let's get our net around it, just so he doesn't slide by us. And we know we have an electric eel here, right? Yeah. Let's do that. All right, we know there's an electric eel in this hole. We can hear it. So we've quickly looped our net all the way around the hole. So the eel can't escape. The only problem is we gotta somehow figure how to get the eel out of the hole and into the net. Somewhere among these roots is our missing electric eel. Oh! You got the bottom of the net? Bring the bottom of the net. Ah! Ah! Yeah, I felt it! I felt it! Dongwu Ling Jiu Li, Huang Ye Wednesday, 晚上九点，国家地理频道。